assalamu alaikum and welcome to my channel we educators today you are going to study about biological control biological control is the use of living organisms to suppress pest populations making them less damaging than they would otherwise be natural enemies of insects play an important role in limiting the densities of potential pests these natural enemies include predators parasitoids and pathogens as pests are those species that attack some resource we have human beings want to protect and to it successfully enough to become either economically important or just a major annoyance they are only a tiny fraction of the insect species around us even many of the species would recognize as important pests only occasionally do significant damage to us or our resources natural enemies play an important role in limiting the densities of potential pests this has been demonstrated repeatedly when pesticides have devastated uh, the natural enemies of potential pests insects which are previously of the of little economic importance often become damaging pests when released from the control of their natural enemies conversely when a non toxic method of found to control a key pest uh, the reduced of pesticide and increased survival of natural enemies frequently reduce the numbers and damage of formerly important secondary pests the three categories of natural enemies of insect pests are predators parasitoids and the pathogens predators many different kinds of predators feed on insects insects are an important of part of the diet of many vertebrates including birds amphibians reptiles fish and mammals these in these insectivorous vertebrates uh, usually feed on many insect species and rarely focus on pets in unless they are very abundant insect and other arthropod predators are more often used in biological control because they feed on a small range of prey species and because arthropod predators with their shorter life cycle and may fluctuate in population density is response to change in the density of their prey important insect predators include lady beetles ground beetles or row beetles flower bugs and other predatory true bugs number 2 is parasitoids parasitoids are insects with an immature stage that develops on on in a single insect host and ultimately uh, kills the host the adults are typically free living and may be predators they may also feed on other resources such as honey dew plant nectar or pollen because parasitoids may be adapted to the life cycle physiologic and defenses of their host they are limited in their host range and many are highly specialized thus accurate in the identification of the host and parasitoid species is critically important in using parasitoids for biological control now number 3 is photogons insects like other animals and plants are infected by bacteria fungi protozoans and viruses they, that cause diseases these diseases may reduce the rate of feeding and growth in of insects pests slow or prevent their reproduction or kill them in addition insects are also attacked by some species of uh, nematodes that uh, with their bacterial symbiotes and cause diseases or death under certain environmental condition diseases can multiply and spread naturally through an insect population particularly when a density of the insect is high so today's video is about biological control how parasite pesticides and the pathogens are damaging each other these insects and these animals how we are can control these damages this is the biological control so hopefully you have learned a lot from today's video so if you like my video give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe my channel take